Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Civilization 5, the Ottoman Petri Dish, where we're continuing to seek domination over the Petri Dish, which is something that's maybe happening rather in a rather interesting way, given how Gandhi and Kamahale, or Polynesia, are in cohorts against us. For the most part, everyone else is quite on quite good terms with us, you know, neutral, friendly, 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 it's just these two. I don't know which one of them. I think it was Polynesia. They don't like how our borders are clashing. And their foolish city-states thought it was a good idea to get into a war with someone of my power. <laughs> Fools. Anyway, these workers have, fi have gotten the, 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 the oil refinery up, so now we finally have access to oil. So, once we research electronics, we'll have access to battleships. How glorious. <laughs> and the fools here thought it would be a good idea to put some Great War inventory in the water and you guys are the definition of dead since you're in the face of a Gatling gun. So, pillage the f- oh. Is that your last movement point? Either way, these ships, I'm going to pull them back for the time being. Yes, that's right, get that incense. Ooh, do we have spices? Yeah, evidently not. I'm not seeing any. I think that's everything we've built around here. Hmm. The Inca might not like the fact that our borders here are clashing. Our borders are clashing everywhere now because everyone's just setting up cities all over the place. Hmm. I don't think there's any... Although, if we claim this aluminum... No, go back there. What are you doing? Where are you? Ah, oh, damn it. I just have to hope we can... When are we going to get... Eight turns? I don't know if Jakarta's going to get it first. My unit needs, or needs orders. <laughs> oh look, some more Great War infantry for me to shoot at. Frigates! Oh, fire! Your flimsy wooden boats are nothing. I'm going to... I think I'm going to send these ships over to that city because these should be easy conquests and I don't want them attacking Izmir. But I'm gonna... how far away are we? Hold on. Let's have a look. Actually, all we need to do next is get flight and then we'll have electronics. Alright, so that's all good. And... I think that's it. Plus, of course, we're cranking up research labs now, so our science output is skyrocketing. <laughs> What's this? Ah, yeah, there. Oh, so that's where that Mongolian settler was going. Well, they're finally spreading their influence somewhat. I didn't want them to, but... Took them long enough. And it's 1876. We have guns, so your crosswomen are nothing to us. And, uh, these several thousand year old spearmen are dead. And so are those Grey Wall infantry because they're so bleeding stupid. That's it. Go, Leon! Mombasa? Is that another city-state? I don't think I've ever seen city states attacking other city states. That's something new. Ooh, that might be something I have a chance at. Although, if they're behind in research, they might find it easier to get through a few techs. These are floodplains, so. plus four gold. You get plenty of food from these uh, 
putting the wheat, so, you know, set up a trading post. Destroy them. <laughs> Flimsy wooden boats. Puny. Hey, you. Go up there. And you know what? You pull back as well. So you can all heal. And also... When do I get destroyers? Destroyers dis with combustion. Why not get that for a while so the uh, privateer can continue up on that route? Just to keep an eye on things. And so I must refrain the urge to spend a large quantity of money. You know what, you can go over to them. Once you've finished the Statue of Liberty, I want you to start cranking out work boats so we can start harvesting the reserves of oil that we have access to in our coastlines. Public school. Crank out that science. You can never have enough science and you don't even have a library. So you know what I want you to do? Build a bleeding library. Good, they're working on that farm. And they even have oil! Ooh, but that city there. That's gonna be a problem. But at least we got the oil before they did. Oh. Was that the Indian city? Or was that another boat? Richard the Rittington. Go on, go in there. Unless you're at war, which I don't think so because they're not shooting you. Alright, Polynesia, what are you going to do? You haven't even hit any of my units yet. <laughs> Should I even bother? They might be stupid and go into the water. In fact, if I destroy enough of their units like that, it might intimidate them into thinking, Oh, those guys are pretty badass. Maybe we should reconsider going to war. Yes! What? How dare they? How dare they? Hang on. Military science is all the way back there. Some poor stolz still in the industrial era. Okay. Ah oh, yes, definitely a stadium. We okay. That leads to electronics. If we go for penicillin, we'll be on a. We'll get to the atomic era. But I want battleships, and I need oil for battleships. You want a trading post? You're getting plenty of food from the jungles, so I can get with that. So just stay there. I'll upgrade you later. You can actually stay there because I can upgrade you then. Just have a peek around the city and stay there. Sleep. And everyone, in fact, I could just buy a workboat and get that oil right now. It's not doesn't cost that much. Yeah, that'd be done easy, easily enough. And can I actually purchase any religious buildings? Yes, I can. Get a pagoda. Or oh, look at all their happiness. Oh, 82 from excess happiness and science. Glorious. Right, you guys over there. See if we can nab that aluminum. Who desires it? Is the following trade of interest to you? Sweeten the deal, Washington. I want more. All right. Thank you very much. <laughs> Suckers. How much will it cost to upgrade a frigate to a battleship? Pretty sure it's. Nope. 
Anyone else desire an audience with me? Because if so, it better be in my favour, not bleeding open borders. Hang on a minute, did the Americans set up another? They have! San Francisco, the sons of a... I don't know about you, but I'm slightly worried that we might end up with tensions with Washington because their borders are starting to surround my colonies. Excellent. Good job, agents. I don't need you to... Uh, what's the way? I don't need you to steal any tech because we're probably furthest in technology. Ooh, we've impressed some... Aha! Uh -huh. They all love the king because we've got incense. Our golden age has ended, but we have impressed. Oh, and we've got even more culture because we've impressed. Oh, you're just asking for it. They're out of range. We are out of range, aren't we? Yeah. Destroy them. Oh, yes. Glorious destruction of the fools who thought they could attack us. Now, who? <laughs> Look at that. The Swedish trireme. That's thousands of years out of date, Sweden. Work boat! Plus three production. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Get yourself patched up. You two remain stationed. You have that incense now, so get a bit more food. Choose production. I could. We don't even have a forge. Is there any more oil that offshore that we don't have? And take all of my colonies. Ah, yes, right there. Workboat's going to take a bit of time to get there, and it might, and the workboat might get blown up on the way. But we'll see. Wait, ironclads, are they more powerful than. Yeah, they're far more powerful than privateers, except they require coal. And there's no ocean tile, so. Might actually be worth it. Now, I think we can do without an extra factory. Yeah. And besides, I'm sure there'll be some other sources of coal around. Public school. Our science is still going up. We've got so much bleeding happiness. Might we even clock 1,000 happiness? Who desires an audience? Nah, screw it. That's only a measly amount of gold. Although I won't actually need the iron soon because then... Because battleships require oil. Far more modern. Iron becomes practically useless once you reach the modern eras. What's this? Oh no you don't. That's a fairly even match. Yeah, but I don't want you to get a single ship getting too close to the city and Oh, you're really pushing it, Polynesia. In stupidity because you're just throwing your troops away for no reason. Alright, silly states, hurry up! I wanna take my next turn. The enemy has been spotted everywhere. I have so much bleeding money. Oh, wait, now we've got access to the wheat. Whoops! We've set up a farm, good. Get that oil. Workboat, where's the oil? There you are. Nine turns. I could have just purchased a workboat there, but. Hello! Ah. 
When are you going to... You're not even going to get that damn aluminum, are you? You're going that way. Because you want the fish. Yay, yay, yay. Oh, plus four. Oh, that's going to cause our science to shoot up. Look at all this. So what's this? Production, that's going to... Nah, science. This isn't exactly going to be a major city producing thing. Workers, is there anything else I can do with you around here? Probably not. Since others are ready building everything that we need in terms of improvements. So you know what? Just die. Save us a bit of cash. And you get out of there. But not before blowing something up. You like blowing things up, those pathetic wooden boats of Polynesia. What's this? Bankow Stadium. You again. What are you doing sending your workers over here? Flight in one turn. Then we get electronics. And then we get battleships. So glorious. And then we can actually shoot at enemy cities without fear of being re of retaliation. Maybe we'll end up clocking a thousand science by the time we reach the atomic era. <laughs> In fact, at the rate we're planning to tech tree, it might not be long before we can start pursuing the old, the oh so delightful science victory. <laughs> Look at all the conflict that's brewed up with the city states after those two declared war on me. We both have our selection of allies when it comes to these puny... Well, I'm not calling you puny. Well, you are puny compared to us. But you're still helpful because you're giving me a lot of culture. Ah! Now every... All of, so now all of those science... Those scientists that we... Ah. Uh, all of those scientists that we deployed in that other city... All, sorry, all those scientists that we deployed in that other city out there will give that city extra production. Alright, frigate, get yourself patched up. You know what? Go over there. And you, head that away. Marcus Attilius Regulus. Uh, no, stay there. A new policy, how glorious. Aha! A research lab. And crank out some of those. Plus 17 science universities? I'll take it. Oh, that's an extra 80 science right there. So we can have electronics in four turns. What are they doing? Polynesia, you freak. You freaking moron. Okay.